tell us more about what Moonves had to say. Well, it's interesting, Emily. This was an event uh, put on by the Television Critics Association so that CBS can talk about its upcoming shows. But the first question that everybody had for Les Moonves is, what's going on in this thief fight with Time Warner Cable? And Moonves made it clear he doesn't want CBS to go dark. He doesn't want it to go off the air in some markets. But he also wants CBS to get paid properly for its content. And this goes back to a back and forth we've been seeing develop over the last decade. Uh, the cable players have been paying cable channels a lot more for their content and the networks have looked at that trend and said hey wait a minute we still get actually more viewers in a lot of cases and CBS is right at the top with shows like NCIS we want to get paid more for that content Time Warner Cable uh, and other pay TV providers in the past have said hold on how much are you looking for and Time Warner Cable has gone very public with this so don't be surprised if even though there is a deadline today if they have to push that deadline back because they just can't get to the same page Emily Okay. And meantime, Moonves also talked about or addressed the rise of Netflix and Amazon and how both of those companies are working on original programming and how that's changing the way CBS picks shows. Tell us about that. Yeah. Well, a great example is the show Under the Dome from the Stephen King book, which has been a hit for them this summer, because that's a show that not only does well in the ratings, but then airs on Amazon streaming service four days later. And Moonves said Jeff Bezos of Amazon recently came up to him and said, this is working out great for us. But as far as CBS, in the past, they've liked shows that can stand alone one episode on its own, like CSI, because that worked really well when you're selling it to the cable channels where people randomly watch a show. Now with the binge viewing strategy, that might shift their strategy. We've certainly seen that with a show like Hostages, which is coming to CBS soon.